going to cook some onion in this oil. This is a small onion which I finely chopped. And we're going to let this cook for 5-6 minutes until the onion is softened and translucent. I'm going to add 4 large garlic cloves which I minced. We're going to cook that stirring often uh, until we can smell the garlic for maybe a minute. I'm going to add a teaspoon of dried oregano. And a small piece of bell pepper which I finally diced. Cook that until the bell pepper softened a bit. And add a tablespoon of uh, tomato paste. This one's still frozen. I always freeze it when I, you know, open a can and have leftover. I'm going to add about a cup of tomato sauce. Okay. Now this happens to be. Uh, three large tomatoes which I peeled and uh, just put in the blender, but you can use store-bought. And I'm going to add about half a cup of water. And add about a half a teaspoon of sugar. If you're vegan, make sure you're using organic sugar or, you know, you can sweeten it with agave if you want. It's just to balance the acidity of the tomato. I'm going to season this with salt and pepper. I'm going to cover this pot and I'm going to let this simmer for 20-30 oh, minutes. Our sauce is nice and ready. Heat. I'm going to turn off the heat and add about a quarter cup of freshly chopped basil. You might want to taste it and see if you have to adjust the salt. You can keep this sauce in the refrigerator for four days in a nicely closed container. Uh, you can also freeze it. Freeze is beautiful. Serve it with whatever pasta you want. You can serve it with mozzarella, uh, you know, cheese sticks. Uh, you can serve it with anything that you like to dip marinara sauce in. Polenta. It's very nice and easy and super healthy. You can eat this clean like this, super clean. <laughs> or you can add a little grated cheese if you want, whatever you want. The thing is, this sauce is absolutely beautiful. Mmm, mmm. Oh yes, perfect. So I hope you liked this video, and if you did, I hope you give me a like. And if you haven't subbed, you sub. And if you could share and comment, that would be just spectacular. <laughs> I will have this recipe on the website waiting for you guys to come and print it whenever you want. In the meantime, eat well without going broke. I'm gonna see you soon.